hi guys so today we are making vegetable spaghetti so i've just put in my spaghetti and uh, i'm gonna let it cook for about seven to eight minutes that's the typical time to cook spaghetti and then here we have cloves tomatoes red onion cucumber and uh, bell pepper so i'm gonna come right back and i've chopped, chopped this and the spaghetti is cooked so i'm back the spaghetti is done so I'm gonna put some oil like so then I'm gonna put my onion and let them sweat out okay. so we then add our garlic we always put garlic after the onion because they usually burn out uh, very fast so we're going just to cook them for a bit and then we can add the, the other ingredients. So now it's good. As you can see it's getting a little bit golden. Then we're gonna add uh, the bell pepper. Uh, if you've been watching my videos you know I like mine with the seeds like that. I'm gonna add the bell peppers and the tomatoes. We we'll let till the tomatoes are uh, cooked, as in they have to be very well cooked. And at this point, we're gonna add our seasoning. So we're gonna put some salt. We're gonna put some black pepper. I love my black pepper. We're gonna add some turmeric, some Spanish paprika, and some white pepper. So this is how it looks. So this is how it looks. Looks really good. And I also added cayenne cayenne pepper. If you like your food to be spicy, you can add. I did add see how good the, the the seeds from the bell pepper look see how good they look and then we can now add our cucumber we don't want to overcook it so that it can remain crispy this is a good example of a one pot kind of meal it is fast and quite tasty you can never go wrong with this so we let it cook for a bit and we're gonna add the spaghetti so now it's time to add the spaghetti and then we will start So this is how it looks after being stirred. So it's all done now. You just need to stir it for a few minutes and it's done. It's ready to serve. So I'm gonna see you after I serve it. Here are the results. You can see a little bit of everything. And the cucumber has cooked very well. So we're gonna try and taste it. So here it goes. Mm. it is good you can taste the pepper and also the cucumbers are very crunchy which is a good thing we do not overcook so here are the end results thanks for watching and kindly do subscribe and wait for my next video bye, bye.